So uh, one single document that, that you will get from the Ministry of Labor and Vocational Training is called Declaration of Enterprise Open Certificate. Welcome to our regular podcast on doing business in Cambodia. My name is Kim Sopat Kong. I am the CEO of Making It Easy. The previous podcast, I have shared about what you will get out of the registration package from the Ministry of Commerce, General Department of Taxation. In this podcast, I like to share about what you will get out of the registration package as well, which is registered under CAMDA program. So. Uh, one single document that, that you will get from the Ministry of Labor and Vocational Training is called Declaration of Enterprise Open Certificate. This is simple and automatically coming out under the registration package. Uh, it's just the basic registration and for the future when you have employee coming in or going out or even if you plan to hire more foreign employee, you need to update and you need to apply for quota for them. And Ministry of Labor and Vocational Training is not attached to National Social Security Fund. So uh, one more aspect, one more document that you will get is from the National Social Security Fund. It is called Enterprise Registration Certificate. So every newly registered company, you need to register under this entity. It's a must, it's compulsory. It is different from other insurance uh, private insurance companies to choose to buy uh, insurance from private company is optional it's the choice of employers but to register and buy the insurance uh, packages under the national social security fund is compulsory it's a must there are three aspects are you a foreigner looking to expand your business in Cambodia at Making It Easy, we specialize in helping you to navigate the complexities of doing business in the kingdom. Here what we offer. Register and close business or NTO. Tax compliant. Business address. And business compliant consultancy. Stop stressing about doing business in Cambodia. Contact us now for the assistance. To buy and to benefit the employee under this program. It is the insurance to cover accident for them the insurance to cover health for them, also pension fund. So maybe it's something new in Cambodia or especially to uh, employers, but uh, I would like to address that based on my experience. National Social Security Fund is a new program and very attractive and they provide a lot of benefits to the employee. So my recommendation is to understand more about this entity and try to register all of your employees under this uh, program to uh, get access to the benefit for them. So um, to stay tuned on our regular podcast on doing business in Cambodia, please follow or subscribe our social media platform. Thank you. Making it easy, your trusted partner.